It is December 21st and we're supposed to be flying home with Bubba on December 23rd. Our flight just got canceled. So we are just in purgatory waiting right now. I am in the car on the cell phone lot and we'll see what happens and see if we're gonna get out of Seattle today because as of right now, it doesn't look like we will. Well, we may not have landed in Sun Valley, but we are in Boise. It is now the 22nd, so we are on track to bring Bubba home tomorrow. We just got to get an Uber, get to our rental car, because there were none left in the airport, and then drive to Sun Valley. Two and a half hours later, and we're in Haley. Just gonna drop the rental car, get picked up, and we'll be at Omega. Hey, hey, down. So this is Mr. Bubba. He's been featured in a lot of our videos. And this is who we're bringing home. We are excited to bring him home to our pack. And he was, so Sunny, our dog Sunny, was living in here with Bubba, actually, um, a while back when Sunny was still here. And they were besties. So we're really excited for them to be brought back together. We're excited for him to meet all the other dogs. Um, this is an enclosure he lives in right now with another dog named Joy, who is adoptable and she's looking for her forever home. Bubba is a Pyrenees, Akbosh, Anatolian mix, weighing in right around 126-ish pounds. He's about three years old and tomorrow he is coming home with us to his forever home just outside of Seattle. Mr. Bubba? Can you tell me what it's going to be like to fly in a private jet? Mr. Bubba, can you tell me if you've ever been flown in a private jet before? That definitely meant no. Definitely not. <laughs> the biggest nose boop. <laughs> the lens is just like one big boopage. Joy, are you wanting to find your forever home? That was a yes, it's been way too long. Yeah. Bubba, oh my gosh, he's a gem. And he came into rescue just earlier this summer of 2022, in May, I guess, in 2022. We don't have a lot of history on Bubba. We don't know what his life was like, uh, where he was born, yeah, you know, whether he was a working dog or a family dog. What we do know is that he was brought into a shelter, a shelter rescue from a family who couldn't keep him. And we don't know the circumstances surrounding that. We heard that this family had other animals, other livestock, um, things like that, and they were losing their, their farm. So they ended up having to get rid of all the animals and Bubba was one of those relinquished. So he ended up here at Unega where he can be a big gentle giant that he is, free to roam and bark and be a good boy. He's an amazing dog. And he is also this Christmas finding his forever home. And um, again, we're just thrilled. Um, okay, so we're in the new puppy section. Um, we just got these guys a few days ago. We've got Waylon, Willow, and Winnie. Um, two girls and a boy and um, they're safe with us for sure but ready to learn about home life um, so if anyone is interested in fostering or adopting please reach out I'm Nicole and I work here at Unega helping to take care of these dogs and um, I am our adoption and rescue coordinator and so work side by side with Tiffany to help get these dogs into homes and uh, save their lives. What's the current status of our flight home? Um, well, first it got delayed by just a little bit. 
and now it is up in the air as if it's gonna be delayed till later today, delayed till tomorrow, or canceled. So we are waiting and eating pizza. Our flight yesterday got canceled. So yesterday was the 23rd, and that was the day we were supposed to fly home. And there was really, really icy conditions in Seattle. Like the roads were like ice rinks, um, kind of insane. Our flight got canceled, so now it's the 24th. We're supposed to fly out here at noon, but they're not sure which airport they're gonna land at right now because of potential fog. So we're waiting to hear. We hope they decide before they take off. If they don't, we have to go to a halfway point. And then once they decide, go to either direction because this is our last chance to get home before Christmas. So it's kind of non-negotiable. So we are gonna figure it out and get home today. It's time, the plane is officially landing in Sun Valley, which is awesome, but just landing a little early, gonna depart a little early, so we need to rock and roll out of here. We're going to grab Bubba right now. Oh, all the things that went into getting this guy home. The trip was supposed to be one day. It's now been four days in the works, I think. So we're just excited to finally get him home on Christmas Eve. Bubba. It's okay, hey, buddy. Well, Bella, we made it. Dude, we made it. Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve, we're back just in time to go to dinner with the fam. Make sure we spell Bubba to the other pups. Uh, he gets a little car sick and he did great the whole flight, but then it got started to get a little drooly towards the end, but luckily we made it through. We had backup contingencies in place, but he made it. We're here. Excited to bring him to the house. 